<clears throat> I don't know. It's just, I mean, I almost killed us. The company. That is so selfish. I mean, if we have to get a million users, I, I need to get us funding right now. How? We've already been turned down by every respectable VC in town. Who said anything about respectable? Oh, Richard, no. Fuck yes, I want to talk business. What's the play? Let's fuck this thing right in the pussy. Thanks for meeting me here. My fucking nanny got another DUI and lost her license, and now I'm stuck picking up my own kid like an asshole. So what's up? Uh, well, <clears throat> I, I know you wanted to buy Ehrlich's Pied Piper shares back in the previous iteration, the platform. Well, I was, I was hoping you'd want to come on as a follow-on investor for the current platform. The video chat? Yeah. It's got great tech. Uh, we're growing like crazy. In fact, that's why we need funding to keep up with the users. And uh, I think it could be really good if we can just keep it going. No, you don't. What? You don't like it. You don't believe in this product you're selling. <laughs> Russ. No, that's, it's a good, sound business. As, as I said, the tech is great, and all the guys are really behind it. Well, you're not behind it, Richard. I can tell, and as much as you want to be, you're not. Look, it's like this. You're trying to date a woman, but deep down in your heart, you know you're gay. Uh, but deep in your soul, you know you would rather be plowing a dude. I don't, I don't, okay, what dude? It could be any dude, as long as you really want to fuck him. It could be a, a twink, a bear, an otter, a circuit queen, a chub, a pup, a gipster, a daddy chaser, a leather man, a lady boy, a Donald Duck. Really? Donald Duck's a gay guy who's been kicked out of the Navy. How do you know so many gay things? My grandfather just came out of the closet. Beautiful, very inspiring. But the point is, oh. if you're gonna spend all day fucking, shouldn't Pied Piper be a dude you wanna fuck? All right, let's do an exercise. You've got unlimited time and resources. You can build anything in the world you want with your compression, anything at all. What's it gonna be? Three, two, one, oh, go. No, I, I don't... Go, go, go. You said I have unlimited time. Now, now, now. A, a new internet. What? Why? Okay, well, I, I haven't really thought this through, so. Um, okay. I own a telescope. Of course you do. And uh, I brought it out one night to look at the full moon. Of course you did. And uh, I got to thinking, well, we put a man on the moon using the computing power of a handheld calculator. And then I thought, okay, there's literally millions of times more computing power in my phone, and that's just sitting in my pocket, doing nothing, right? So then I thought, there's, what, billions of phones all around the world with the same computing power just sitting in people's pockets. So then I thought, what if we use all those phones to build a massive network. And here's the kicker. We use my compression algorithm to make everything small and efficient to move things around. And if we could do it, we could build a completely decentralized version of our current internet with no firewalls, no tolls, no government regulation, no spying. Information would be totally free in every sense of the word. You want to build a new internet? Yes. Richard, I like it. That I would fund. Well, I, I, I don't know if it's possible. And Look, if this new internet is the man of your dreams, and this is the man that you want to fuck, then you need to fuck him. That man, I will pay you to fuck. What the fuck is that kid? Wait a minute. Ah, shit. They kicked us out of this place. I'm at the wrong fucking school. Richard, you find that man, fuck him good. Careful, please. He's gonna peel out.